an undocumented Zimbabwean in South Africa who scooped over R8.2 meters, USD $526.000, and lottery winnings, lost the money after being conned by a friend had pledged to receive the money on his behalf because he did not have a South African bank account to receive the funds. According to reports, Emmanuel Mendia played and won the national lottery in November 2019 and won over R8. 2 meters but without the necessary papers he had no way of getting the money. Foreigners can legally play the lotto in South Africa, but they have to meet certain criteria before claiming their prize officially including having a valid permit to enter the country with your original passport as well as having a local bank account. Mendia as a result reached an agreement with Kangani Moyo to receive and deposit the winnings in his bank account. Moyo was supposed to ask Standard Bank to issue two bank cards to enable Mendia to access the funds. The millions were paid into Moyo's bank account on December 5, 2019 and between the following day and March 5, 2020 he had transferred R6 meters of the R8. 2 meters into another Standard Bank account, also in his name. Another R1.8 meters was transferred to the Standard Bank account. Realizing he had been conned, Mendia reported the matter to the police on March 6, 2020 leading to Moyo's arrest on March 26 last year. Dot Moyo was detained by Midrand police and appeared before the Alexandra Magistrates Court and was released on bail of R5000, which was paid by his family. He has since absconded. It was reported this week that the National Director of Public Prosecutions Shamila Batohi has now frozen more than R3. 2 million held in Moyo's bank accounts and a warrant for his arrest had been issued. Batohi asked the court for a preservation order which could not be served on Moyo because he absconded and is currently untraceable. The judge dealing with the case has ordered that the remaining funds be forfeited by Moyo and directed into a trust fund for the victim, Mendia, that will be held by Mabunda.